Taylor's IPC2000 is adaptable to nearly any discharge or D-Way application using bulk bags. The IBC2000 can easily be modified with a number of options in order to handle your specific requirements. These include hoist and trolley, bag agitators to facilitate unloading, iris valves, and dust containing discharge outlets. Process of unloading, starting, and removal of a bulk bag on Taylor's IBC2000. Locate UPD, Universal Pickup Device, and use a forklift to lift it directly above the bulk bag. Hangers are on top of the UPD. Attach bulk bag straps to the UPD hangers and lift bag to make sure load is secure. Before bringing bag and unloader, check that the adjustable UPD hanger tubes are at the correct height for your bag. The bag should be slightly stretched while resting on top of the pan and thumpers. Bring bag and unloader. Be aware of the front risers on the unloader frame. UPD will fit into pockets on the hanger tubes. Bag unload spout should be directly over the hole in the pan. Remove the forklift from the UPD. Open the optional hopper door and locate cords to untie the spout. Product will start to empty from the bag. Close door. This unloader has massagers and pumpers. To start the process of unloading, press the start button located on the control panel. This will start the thumpers and massagers. Must be selected on on the control panel. Massagers and thumpers will run until the stop button is pressed. Once the bag is empty, retie and tuck in the unloading spout into the bag so trace of the product don't make a mess. Using the forklift's forks, pick up the UPD and remove it in the empty bag. Dispose of the bag and you're ready for a new bag. Products typically handled with an IBC 2000 bulk bag unloader. Powders, fertilizers, calcium, salt, resins.